objectives. Compares two sets using the expression less than, more than, and as many as, and order sets from least to greatest and vice versa. Hello kids! Today, we will learn a new lesson. Are you excited? Let's go! But before anything else, let us have a short review of our previous lesson. Give the tens and ones in a given set. How many tens and ones are there? Great job! The answer is 6 tens and 4 ones. How many tens and ones are there? The answer is 3 tens and 5 ones. How many tens and ones are there? Wonderful! The answer is 9 tens and 7 ones. Now that we are done reviewing our past lesson, we will proceed to our new topic. Compare the following sets of objects. Set A has two mangoes and set B has six pieces of fruit juices. Which is less? I know you've got an idea. Set A is fewer than set B. Why? Because we only have two mangoes in set A and six pieces of juices in a can in set B. Now here's another. Which is more? Let's take a look. Oh, set A has seven shampoos and set B has three soaps. Now, which is more? All right. Set A is many compared to set B. Now here's next. Compare the sets. Set A has six marbles and set B has six Christmas bulbs. Now, what would be the answer? All right! Set A and set B has the same number of objects. Why? Because they both have six pieces each. Now, what did you do to compare the objects in a given set? Of course, we count the objects inside the set. Now, 
let's go over the lesson. Less than is used when a set of objects is fewer or lesser than the other set. Let's try to look at the example. A set of bananas is less than the set of apples. You try to count the bananas and the apples. Yes, we use less than because we only have three bananas in set A and in set B we have five apples. Another example, we use less than because the set of bananas is fewer than the set of apples. A set of apples is more than the set of bananas. In set A, we have 5 apples, and in set B, we have 3 bananas. So that explains why we use more than. We use more than because the set of apples is many compared to the set of bananas. A set of fish is as many as the set of squid. Oh, they're so cute. We use as many as if the number of objects in a set are the same. That explains in this set why we use as many as. It's because set A has three fishes and set B has three squids. The fish and squid has the same number. It's game time! Yes, you are going to write less than, more than, or as many as in the given sets compared. Take note, you should count. Set of cows is blank set of pigs. What do you think is the correct answer? The answer is set of cows is more than set of pigs. Why? Because we have nine cows in set A. And in set B, we have four pigs. Here's next. Set of stars is blank set of hats. Very good. The correct answer is... Set of stars is less than set of hats. In set A, we have 5 stars, and in set B, we have 8 hats. Another set of pencil is blank set of eraser. What do you think is the answer? Wonderful! The correct answer is, set of pencil is as many as set of eraser. Take note, they have the same number. Four pencils and four erasers. Let's have more! Arrange the sets in order from least to greatest which means small to big number. Look at the illustration. 
we have six peaches, three puppies, four apples, and seven hamburgers. Now, you arrange it from least to greatest. And the answer is 3, 4, 6, 7. Very good! Now, arrange from greatest to least, which means from big to small number. The first set has 8 apples, the second set has 3 pineapples, and the third has six horses. Now go, arrange it. Wonderful! The correct answer is eight, six, and three. Congratulations! Always take note, to compare sets of objects, you count it first. Use less than, more than, and as many as to compare sets. Now here's another technique. To avoid error in using terms for comparing sets, count the first set and compare it to the other set. so much kids how i hope that you have learned something today please don't forget to hit and click the subscribe button till next time bye